Hey guys, it's AJ, and I am burning up in my kitchen again because Ironhead41 told me I could can hot dogs, so I just had to try that out. Um, I put 12 hot dogs in a quart jar, wiped off my lids and rings like always, did everything, got everything ready, everything's going good, my temperature's up, um, it's been going for oh, about four minutes now, so we're in the process and it's gone. But the reason why I came in and started canning something was because I had all kinds of things to do in my kitchen. Um, as you guys know, I haven't been on a whole lot lately because, uh, well, all the blog shows and things keep me kind of busy and we've been doing a lot of remodeling to the old house that we now own and it uh, gets a little hectic. So I looked around and I thought, oh, i got to do dishes, I've got to pick this up, um, I need to do this, I need to do that. So since I was going to have to be in my kitchen for a while, I thought, oh, might as well get the canner going. Um, also, I had heard something that I really wanted to try, and uh, it's kind of an experiment, but I made salad in a jar. And the premise of this is, supposedly, if you do it this way, it's not only ready to go and eat, but if you put a new canning lid on, screw your ring down really well, put these in the fridge, these are supposed to last four to five days easy. And um, I was being bad and uh, wasting money, in my opinion, and buying pre-made salads because they just went in the fridge and I just pull one out and eat them and that's what I usually have for lunch every day. So today, instead of doing that, I bought a head of lettuce, it's 98 cents. Um, I, bought, I bought three tomatoes, but I only used one. Uh, I believe they were a little over a dollar a pound. Um, I bought diced ham. And this stuff is really not bad priced. And I like a little bit of protein in my salads. And uh, as you can see, I didn't even come close to using half of the bag. So I'll see how the first one works out, make sure I have enough, and then I'll freeze this for next week. I like Kobe Jack cheese. $2 pack of Colby Jack cheese, and you know, I, I didn't even use a quarter of the pack, maybe. So, uh, last thing, I, I like egg in my salad. Um, and I only made four because that's just what was in the carton that I happened to grab at the time. So, I left egg out of one. And in the last one that I do, I'm going to put in an oxygen absorber, and that's going to be the last one I eat. Um, if I want an egg, I'll just make one real quick. But, um, I want to see if that helps. The people that I've been watching and listening to when they do this, they don't use an oxygen absorber, they just screw it down. So I want to see if there's a difference and if I can make them last a couple more days that way or if there's really nothing going on at all. Um, when everybody else does this, they start out by putting their salad dressing in the bottom of the jar, then they put everything else except the lettuce. The lettuce goes on top. That way your salad dressing isn't marinating those lettuce leaves and making them all nasty and slimy. So if you like salad dressing, which I don't, um, that's another way that you can do it. I've uh, got to find my oxygen absorbers here. And I have a little bubble down there that tells me they're still good. going to drop one down in the one without an egg because I don't know that kind of freaked me out having an egg in my refrigerator for four days is a little weird as it is so that may be something that I decide not to do next time but this is the first time thing and like I said I just want to try it I want to see how it works I was already canning I was already sweating in my kitchen uh, I had a lot of stuff to clean up like I said we've just been busy 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 so this will be a quick way something for me just to grab and eat and this is going to cost me a fraction of what I was paying for. And the main reason why I decided not to do that anymore, uh, I was paying, I think, about $4 a salad. I don't eat the dressing. Um, I don't really care for the little tomatoes that they have in there. I like to have a homegrown chopped up tomato. So um, I threw away the tomato. I don't use their fork. I like a real fork. So all of these things I was basically throwing out of my salad and then eating them and I threw away the most expensive parts. So if I can do it myself and cut my cost tremendously, I mean, there's, I bet there's not a $1.50 in this jar. 
So this would be a much cheaper way to have a quick lunch and I'm good for five days. The next five days my lunch is already planned out for me. And probably uh, either the next to the last salad or the last salad I bring out. Um, I will definitely show you the salad that I bring out last because it has the oxygen absorber in it. Um, using brand new lids. Uh, but I'll bring you back and I'll show you and tell you what I think. And maybe we can come up with something that we need to change or I don't know, they might just come out okay. Now, if you're going to try this, they say, and this is all YouTube inspired. Um, I looked up a whole bunch of different ones before I decided exactly what I wanted to do. They say when you do this, unlike when you can't, when you put things on finger tight, you, you want to screw these down nice and tight. Because we're not canning, we are just trying to make them last longer. I think since um, we aren't canning, I'm not 100% positive, I'll play with that and experiment when we pull them out and look at them. Uh, I think since these aren't being pressure canned or anything, they're just sitting on here, I think I can use these same lids again. So these will be set in my refrigerator and I will be eating them every day this week for lunch and you can come back and see if we liked them and see what we think of them, or see what I think of them I should say. Um, and I'll let you know then how the hot dogs turned out too. Uh, should be really good. Um, if I get time, I might hop on after a bit and let you know. Uh, they're going pretty well and i got about 78 minutes left. So I'm going to clean my kitchen and I'll yell at you guys later. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.